Alright guys, what is up? This is your girl, Bofina1, bringing you guys yet another YouTube video. And today, I want to talk to you guys about the Dragon Ball Xenoverse 2 beta that was available this weekend. I believe it ends tonight. I want to give some of my thoughts and also a quick disclaimer. I don't have any gameplay to show in the background from Xenoverse 2 because, well, I couldn't ever get on the server. So, yeah. Um, but this video is just kind of talking about my thoughts on it and things that I, th I feel like they need to improve in terms of announcing or even thinking about having a beta. Number one, the servers. Most people have complained about this. I had this issue. I could not get on the servers. I think I got on for maybe about the two or three hours that I kept trying and trying and trying. I think I only got on for maybe 20 minutes and then I would get kicked off and then I would get back on and um, it's like I would get on play one section a little bit further of the story, get kicked off, get back on after like 50,000 tries, play a little bit more, you know, of the of the story. And then it was like this cycle of like, okay, I in order for me to just get maybe five minutes more into like the story or whatever that they allow you to play or the demo, I had to keep trying to get back on the servers. The servers, they, they just, I don't know what the problem was because you're not playing with people online. You're literally playing by yourself. I didn't quite understand why there was an issue with being able to go through the story and just kind of see if you like it. Because to me, although it's a beta, but to me that makes me think that the game itself servers may be crap. Because they were the first one. Dragon Ball Xenoverse, the first one, was terrible. Certain times of the nights, if you didn't get if you did not load your character on their servers after a certain time of the night when everybody was getting off work and getting off from class, you literally could not like get in it was terrible you cannot get in so me personally I kind of feel like that makes me think like okay when Xenoverse 2 come out because it, it, they only have like what a week and a day until it comes out that makes me think that you know their servers are gonna be trash to be honest with you and I pre-ordered the game so for me it's kind of like all right I'm hoping that the servers don't end up being bad and they do actually end up being good because I would hate for you know this game that so many of us have you know waited for and are really interested in and I feel like for that to be have been a beta they should have gotten the servers together and it, it just makes you wonder when everybody else is crashing come you know next week Tuesday trying to get on are their servers gonna crash are they still gonna have the same issue I know they supposedly made the servers like seven times bigger than they were. I can't even get on the server on the beta what makes you think I might be able to even get on when the game actually launches and then also that makes the game look bad for people that maybe, hmm, maybe I want to buy this game, maybe not. And so if they can't get on, then they're like, well, this is crap. I don't want to play this. I'm just going to move on. So I don't know, guys. Um, I'm hoping that the game ends up being good. It looks really good. I haven't even got a chance to really see anybody even stream it because no one can get on. So that's been a big issue since the first and I'm hoping that they'll be able to, you know, change that for when the game actually comes out next Tuesday. I'm really ex still excited for the game. I just wish that I've been able to play the beta because there was so much hype and, you know, a lot of my friends were trying to play it and just, t it was kind of like a disappointment, you know, like to come download the beta and then know that you can't even play it, you can't get on, you're constantly just sitting there hours and hours and hours, which is what I showed in, you know, the video that I put out yesterday, even though that was only like 34 seconds or so 30 something seconds that was what I was doing for like hours and hours and hours like desperately trying to just get some content to try to like experience how it would f how it feels but unfortunately I couldn't do that so I mean there's not really a whole lot in terms of like the thoughts necessarily of the game but I guess you say these are kind of like what I'm hoping doesn't happen with the game and kind of like uh you know, like fears or whatever of when the the game actually launches. I'm just hoping that people can actually get on the servers and they fix this problem because there were a lot of things that could have been better last game of uh, Universe, the first one when it came out, that would have made the game better. Like the servers, like kicking people out, not having enough content. I mean, just a lot of things. So I'm really hoping that they kind of have tidied that up and whatever is going on, they can fix it before Tuesday. So when Tuesday comes, you know, I'm going to be ready to play. I'm going to be ready to grind. I'm going to be ready to put out content and give you guys a whole bunch of stuff. So yeah, guys, if you found this video enjoyable, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. If you haven't already, don't forget to subscribe to this YouTube channel channel as well as don't forget to follow me on twitter twitch and on facebook and let me know what you guys think down below in the comment section did you guys have issues with the whole beta you know the beta the dragon balls universe beta i don't know 
I saw a lot of people that did. Some people was able to get on, but it was like very few. And I didn't even get a chance to play. I just got so frustrated. I just said like, forget it. Like, oh well, I can't get on, you know. So let me know what you guys think down below in the comment section. Hope you guys have a good rest of your day, and I'll talk to you later. Peace, Fan Army.